16 packs base sword and shield if we don't get at least four ultra rare or better i give two away these two over here in fact we'll switch one of them so you get different artwork snorlax and a zamazenta have the chance of winning these let's see what happens four ultra rares or better hoping we can do that 16 packs that's half a booster box so you'd have thought we could if we don't then you guys win two booster packs simple as that let's get into our first pack so I want the full Jerez or Bear, obviously, for my collection. You guys, I'm hoping you want me to pull them, but I'm guessing that you don't, because you want to win the two packs. So let's see what we get in our first pack. There's a Blitbug there, Tinchow, a Reverse Maractus, and what you know, <laughs> our first pack is going to be a Marnie. So we've got one out of the four needed. We did get the rainbow of this before. But this one is still pretty cool looking, good start. Our second pack then, if you didn't see the last video that I uploaded, we opened all the different sets from the Sword and Shield era, pack from each. We may have packed a Rainbow Charizard, go and check it out, the link's down below. Let's get into this pack. So there's the code for you. Can we get two in a row to start the video? That would be insane. We have a Water Energy. I do like the base set, I haven't opened too much of it, so that's why I'm opening quite a few packs a day, just to see what we get. We have a, you silly Cobra, Reverse, and a Holographic, so it's not an Ultra Rare, but still pretty cool, Oranguru. Pack number three then. I would like to get some of the Doggos, so Sage or Zamazenta, preferably the gold version. I think those cards look awesome. So those would be my main hits. Let's see what we get. Volpix there, that art is awesome. We have a Rosalia. Reverse Feeble, that is a rare. And a Holographic Rhyperior. So we're getting some hollows, but only one Ultra Rare so far. Our next pack then. Got off to a pretty good start so far in terms of hollows. One Ultra Rare, not too bad. Hoping to get a few more before the video ends. Let's see if we can get one in this pack. There's a Diglett, a Hoot Hoot, Scorbunny, a Reverse Energy, and a non-holographic Feeble this time. Tell you what, wouldn't mind packing a Lapras VMAX either. Is one in this pack? Let's see, let's hope. I would say let's pray, but let's not go that far. We have a Bisharp, a Bull Toy, a Galarian Ponyta, very nice looking, a Mincino, Sobble, a Reverse Shelder, and a Mashana non-holographic. Keeping with the Lapras vibes then. So we got a cute looking Sobble on the front there. Let's hope the water Pokemon on the front leads to a walk of po water Pokemon being at the back. Let's see. We have Thwacky, so another, another starter line there, and a Drizzle. There's the Sobble, Baltoy, Salandit, a reverse Rillaboom, so this is really the start pack. That oh, looks actually pretty awesome. I love Rillaboom. And a non holographic Chinchino. So I think we've opened about six packs so far, so we need another Ultra Rare and one of these two to be on track. Is one of them going to be in this pack? There's only one way to find out. Just hit the camera. <laughs> in this pack, we have a Meta Energy, a Metal Saucer behind it as well, the Ponytar again. Minchino, Sobble, Blitbug, a Rosalia, and a holographic Rillaboom this time. So Rillaboom's back to back, getting the hollows, just not the Ultra Rares. So I need an Ultra Rare in this pack to keep us on track for the four Ultra Rares. Try saying that quickly, let's go. Getting into this pack then, there's the code. We'll do a guess the energy on this one, hopefully it'll bring us luck. Fighting, we got it wrong, so maybe we won't get luck. Let's see what we do get in here. There's a Krabby. I like the bubbles around that. Are there bubbles? I think so. Minchino, the Ponytar, Shelter Reverse, and Inteleon non holographic. We're behind the curve now. We need to do some catching up. Can we get an Ultra Rare in this pack? We need to do some catching up. We've only got one so far. We want four. Well, you guys might not because you want some free packs. I want four. Can we get one in here? Royhorn. A Thwacky Reverse and a Mashana non-holographic. Not looking good at the moment. Our next pack then. A 
did love the Sword and Shield games when they came out. So opening cards from this set, really enjoyable. We've won that station, we won that Summer's Enter, the gold versions. Can we get them? We are going to have a Metal Saucer and a non-holographic Cinderace. So we're getting to the point where we need one in every two packs to contain an Ultra Rare. Don't know how likely that is, but we'll give it a go. Can we get some luck in this pack? Shelda, bring us some luck. Four from the back. This one, we, we really need an Ultra Rare in here. Otherwise it's going to get really sketchy. There's a Krogan, you silly Cobra. Minchino, Fulpix, a Sizzlipede. Oh, it's a holographic, but it's not an Ultra Rare. Three and five, anyone? It's actually getting really tense now. Getting down to the wire, five packs left. Four after this one, so we really need a Ultra Rare Bear to be in here. Come on, Spruking Sobble. Roselia, a reverse Mantine, and being <laughs> so many, I should have done that. How many holographics can we pack? It's a holographic Cinderace. Four left now. Here we go then. Ultra rare, ultra rare, ultra rare. Just keep saying it. Maybe we'll then pack one. We got the Raboot to go for Cinderace from the last pack. Goldeen, a reverse. Pin cushion, non holographic more Pico, three packs left, three ultra rare better needed. And to start us off, hopefully with an ultra rare, there's a Lapras VMAX. So in this pack, there's the code. Let's see if we can get another ultra rare. We've got the Marnie, that was in the first pack, I think. We haven't had anything since, well, we've had a lot of hollows, but no ultra rares or better. Can we get one in this pack? No, we can't. So it looks like I'll be giving some packs away. So we will finish opening those two packs. But before we do, I want to give details of how you can win these two packs here. First of all, like the video, subscribe if you're not already. And in the comment section down below, I want you to let me know what your favorite starter from Sword and Shield was. We've had a Cinderace, a couple of Riddle Booms, I think we had an Inteleon. We've had a lot of the evolve forms but what was your favorite start maybe it was the start you started with maybe not mine personally was Sobble I love that little guy that's the one I chose let me know yours and you could possibly win these two packs here so to finish off the video we can't beat the challenge but we can still open these two packs let's go hopefully they're still two ultra rares just because it'd be awesome to pull them but it doesn't matter for the challenge just opening these for fun Hitmonchan, a Hoot Hoot, so talking of the challenge, there's a Score Bunny, Pikachu, looking awesome as usual, Sinistee, a Reverse Krabby, and we do, we do now get an Ultra Rare, a Keldeo V, looking awesome, a bit late, but still cool. Finishing off then with the good doggo, let's see what we get. We have a Ghastly there. Let's go, can we get another Ultra Rare, or better, to finish us off? Let's see, Switch, and there's that Ghastly, Sizzlypede, Yampa, a Reverse, Poke Kid, and, that's not weird actually, and a Turtonator. I hope you enjoyed the video, have a good one.